not an instant. And then you can talk to him and ask your Allah, what is the real thing? What is the truth? You are very, very religious and devoted. <laughs> I'm very touched by your faith. But one thing missing, God. We talk about God all the time. We talk about the last prophet. We talk about the truth, but we don't see it. If only you see what I see, we don't discuss ever again. <laughs> you like to see God now? Will see the light? I can make you see. I can help you, because it's in you. Allah is in you. Because if we don't understand this, if we don't see God, our knowledge is very limited. And the Quran is the true teaching. But people cannot understand. Because you have to be in the level of Muhammad in order to understand Muhammad's word. To rise up the same level, or at least almost the same. Then otherwise there will be a lot of misunderstanding because we rely on our limited understanding instead of God's knowledge. We can discuss forever because I understand different, you understand different. But I love you because I, I have been there. I know there's a great knowledge that nobody can say he understands everything. I just understand whatever God makes me understand. And I'm so grateful for whatever he has bestowed upon me. But forever, we learn forever. Even the prophet learns forever. Because God is limitless. But we could know the whole, but we could know the point. And if we want to know the, but the point, it takes limitless of time. I'm just so happy uh, to, to know God. In our group, we have uh, Muslim, we have Christian, we have Buddhist, we have uh, Jains, we have Hindu, uh, all kinds. We never fight with each other because we, <laughs> we go inside. We know the one and only God which make different by human discussion and describe uh, a little slightly differently by human language and understand even more differently by different brain. You know, some people's brains are different from other brains. Some people's brain are complete, some people's brain are damaged, some people's brain are a little different. Yes, and the background of their education makes their think different, understand different, and the level of consciousness inside makes them different. But it's okay for me, no problem. I do not come to argue with people or, show or tell people that they are wrong, I'm right. I just show the people who are ready to know the real truth behind all these religions and to have the courage to recognize it. So the only answer is to go inside and find the knowledge of the universe yourself, discover the secret, mm -hmm. and then you answer yourself. Because nobody can even prove these things yeah. to you. And when you go in and you come back out again, is it, does the world change? Mm, it changes in a way and it doesn't change. It changes because your attitude changes. Your understanding, your reverence for all life change. Yes. Mm. And you're happier. <laughs> You accept everything because you know it's all the will of God and everything is perfect. Even we didn't see so. We don't see so with the naked eyes, but everything is perfect. Every soul who came here chose his own life and own path and chose his suffering or happiness so that mm, he go back to God in a different way. Mm. Yes. Whenever he's ready... We, we don't, we don't, when we're deciding to embody, do we not uh, also... We never think of having a good time. It's always, oh, I'll suffer that. No, no it's not true. <laughs> All right. It's not true. We had good time too. Right. Oh, I know that. But do we yes. know if we're up here, up there, deciding what kind of a life we're going to have down here? Yes, we decide. We do decide. Yes, we are we God. We choose our parents. We choose our place. Yes, definitely. We were God, and mm. once we choose to come here, we forget that we are God, and that's the purpose. Right. So that we can remember again. Remember your vacation. You go away so that you appreciate your sweet home better? Yes. Even though it's a vacation, still sweet home, you're longing to come back. What the Kuan Yin method of meditation has to offer South Africa, place troubled with crime and violence? This is the place.
where it needs the most, <laughs> if not, uh, if not like every other places. We all need God, especially, especially in time of trouble. But because uh, we do not know where to find Him again, so we suffer. We suffer so that we be reminded of God again. And the Quan Yin Method is just a Chinese name for contemplation on the Word of God, which will be heard uh, at the time of initiation. And with this universal language, God teaches us everything that we need to know, how to manage our life, and show us heaven and His real identity, as well as our identity, then we will know that we are one with God. And further than that, as an individualized God. And of course, once we know God, we became God again. And God cannot be ignorant. God will know what to do with His life. God will know how to elevate His own suffering. God will be God, <laughs> will be powerful again, and loving and easy. Yes, and it doesn't matter in which circumstance, we will be forever happy because we are God. We will know what is it all about, yes? And there will be no hatred in our heart anymore. If everyone knows God, we will be in heaven again. That's the golden age, the true golden age, yes. Supreme Master Ching Hai, what do you think the parliament of the world's religions uh, will leave behind once it's over? I guess uh, people learn to know each other and accept each other's differences more. Mm. Yes. But the real, the real knowledge of brotherhood comes actually by knowing, by knowing that we are one. Mm -hmm. And the only way we know that is through God's knowledge, through our own enlightenment, through our own oneness with God again. And we can learn to to do that every day. And we can learn to have a taste of that immediately at the time of initiation. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes, uh, can you tell um, us here in South Africa what your millennium message is for the whole of South Africa? My message is uh, for every millennium. <laughs> no God, then everything else will be taken care of. Mm -hmm. No God, then and we will be happy. If you know God already, it's good. If you do not know God yet, search for the one who know God. Be him African, be him German, German, be him Indian. Search for the one who can show you the way to remind you to know God again, the light of God. The one who, who knows God is the one who can show you God. The ones who can enlighten you is the one who can show you the light. If anyone can show you the light, he is the one who helps you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Supreme Master Ching Hai. You are most welcome, and we love you. Thank you. Our joy to have you joining us on today's words of wisdom. Up next is music and poetry. Please stay tuned to Supreme Master Television. We wish you a joyous and relaxing weekend. <laughs> <laughs>